JC began to notice that she could hear things quite clearly with no other distractions from the outside world. She could even hear when the man approached her room from the outside. She could tell he was there even before he began unlocking the door. After the man has left JC alone again, she attempts to muster up the courage to explore the rooms attached to hers. She quietly opened the door to the next room. It looked very dark and creepy. There were no windows. As her eyes adjusted to the pitch blackness, she can begin to make things out in the room. There was a drum set and a microphone stand and a set of huge speakers. J.C. had no interest in knowing her captor's name. She figured if she knew his name, that meant he would never let her go. 